Hi and welcome to Planet Cruise TV. My name's Glenn and uh, I'm here today with the pleasure of introducing a very, very special lady. She's made her way over from LA, just arrived into the UK and she's come straight to our offices here. I'd like to welcome Edie Rodriguez, uh, the CEO of Crystal Cruises. Hello. Okay, Edie, so obviously, as I said, you're here to talk about Crystal Cruises, fantastic. What we'd like to know is a little bit about your journey, how you became the Chief Executive Officer of Crystal Cruises. Sure. Well, first, it's my crystal pleasure to be here today. We value our relationship with Planet Cruise, so thank you for the partnership. So I'm in my 35th year, dare I say, of following my passion. I was given great advice as a young girl, find your passion and follow it, get a great education. And my passion was always travel. So I started out in this industry 35 years ago and I worked my way up. I actually started out as a travel consultant right. and I've worked for several other cruise lines and was uh, really quite a great endeavor throughout the years. But I've been with Crystal two years and it's really my passion. Luxury is definitely my passion. So. We understand there's a, a lot of new exciting developments that are happening with Crystal at the moment with the new ships that are arriving over the next couple of years and of course the new Dreamliner aircraft that's arriving. Can you tell us a little bit about what this involves and these developments that are happening and of course the exciting times ahead with Crystal itself? Well, Crystal Cruise has celebrated its 25th anniversary on July 20th of 2015. And in celebration of that anniversary, we have a new owner who is funding billions of dollars literally to grow our brand. I always say you either grow or die. And in the 25 years, Crystal currently has two vessels the world's most awarded luxury cruise line with Serenity and Symphony. And both of these vessels sail from five nights to 128 nights to all seven seas, all seven continents. So they deliver a great, great holiday experience, but it was really time to grow. So how are we now growing? Well, in a myriad of ways, we are really changing the game. And by that, first for the Crystal Cruises brand, we are um, birthing, if you will, three new triplets. We will have three new ocean-going vessels for Crystal Cruises. The first one coming in late 18. Each of those three triplets will host 1,000 guests and will have 1,000 crew to service those guests. They will be all suites. They will have the highest space to guest ratio. And what makes them really unique is that they will be polar class, not just ice class. So that means that we can create itineraries literally from the north to the south pole and anywhere in between and around. And what also makes them unique is that they will each have up to 48 residences on board. So for the first time ever, you will have the combination of regularly scheduled cruise departures concurrently with condo living at sea. So it, they're going to be really, really spectacular. So that's for the Crystal Cruises brand. And then in addition to that, we have several brand extension experiences coming. The first will be our Crystal Yacht Cruises experience. This December December 23rd, we will launch the Crystal Esprit. She is a magnificent yacht that is also all suites. She will host just 31 couples or 62 guests, said another way. And she will have a crew of 77 crew servicing those just 62 guests. Now what makes Esprit really unique is first of all, we're taking all of the ethos and hallmarks of Crystal Cruises and now embodying that in a yachting experience. And so what Esprit has is a marina out the back that flips down. And not only does she have all the water toys, things like sea dews, zodiacs, a slide down the back, but she will also have a 32 foot wider boat. So the way I explain this, it's like the yacht gives birth to the baby yacht. And last but not least, she will have an actual submarine, a submersible that will go down with three people, the captain and two guests. So ceremonially, somebody could have a wedding under the sea if they want. She will do the Seychelles seasonally. And then when she's not in the Seychelles, she will do the Adriatic coast 
from Venice to Dubrovnik and returning Dubrovnik to Venice. And those two weeks of itineraries will be different. So if somebody doesn't want to do a seven night and wants to do a 14 night, they will actually go into different intimate yachting ports. So the Crystal Yacht Cruises experience will be extraordinary, absolutely extraordinary. We're very excited that she's launching just two months, December 23rd, 2015.